Hi guys, so for today's video it is going to be my everyday makeup routine. Obviously I just filmed this look. I wanted to apologize that if my skin looks a little blotchy or like orange or whatever, it's because I just self-tanned before this. So it does look a little crazy, but I will wash it off within a few hours. So this video has been so requested. Everyone wants to know how I do my makeup every day. This is the makeup I wear in almost every single one of my videos. Besides the lip color, I change it up sometimes. But for the most part, this is the look that I do every single day. So if you guys want to see how I do that, keep on watching. Okay, so I hope you guys don't mind this setup, but I'm going to use my vlog camera today. It's so difficult to film with my other camera because it doesn't have a flip-up screen. I can't see what I'm filming or like the angle or whatever. I can't. It's so difficult. And I'm filming by a window right now. Um, I didn't want to film with a very harsh ring light. So I already moisturized my face and everything. It's just like a Cetaphil moisturizer. Um, of course, using the It Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC cream. I use this all the time. Also, I have a mirror over here, so if you see me looking away from the camera, that's what I'm looking at. So today is Saturday. This video will probably be going up on Tuesday. Also, I understand that this shade is a little dark for me. Um, I do self-tan quite a bit, but I'm also going on vacation soon. But I do self-tan, like I said, so it doesn't match my neck and everything. Also, I want to start trying some new makeup. I want to get more into makeup. I used to be super interested in makeup when I was younger, but I'm not so interested in it anymore. I like fashion more so. Like, I'd rather spend my paycheck on clothes or travels or, like, experiences, I guess, rather than makeup and everything. So, um... I kind of just stick to the same makeup. I really don't change it up that much. I would normally bring this down to my neck, but since I just self-tanned, I don't want to do that. The last few days have been so beautiful and warm here, and I'm so ready for winter to be over. It is honestly always so cold here in the winter. I would love to move somewhere where there is no winter. Well, I guess no snow and stuff, but... Okay, so after that, I will take my concealer, which I have been using the Superstay Better Skin Concealer from Maybelline. And this is in the color Ivory number 10. I just got the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer, but I don't think I'm gonna use it until after I come back from vacation because I don't think it'll match my skin, unfortunately. I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills dip brow thing for my brows, but honestly, it's so hard to show this on camera. Okay, now that that's done, I hate doing my eyebrows. Um, I just blend this in. Also, I don't absolutely love that concealer, but I'm just too lazy to go buy new makeup, so I use what I have. I finally got some new brushes. I had been using the crappiest brushes for the longest time. So I finally got some Sonia Kashuk ones. Um, so this one, they don't have names, but it's just kind of like a powder brush, if you can see that. I use the Dermablend Compact Setting Powder. It's just a white setting powder that looks like that. And I just put it everywhere that I have concealer and the areas that get very shiny. And then for the rest of it, I just use what's left on the brush. For bronzer, I've been using Hoola by Benefit. I have had this for so long and I just kind of want to use it up. So I bring this down my neck just to kind of blend everything. And I don't contour or anything, but I just kind of add some color to my face by doing this. Guys, I'm not an expert. <laughs> then I use this um, setting brush by, um, what is this, Real Techniques? I just kind of lightly contour my nose. Highlight, I use Mineralized Skin Finish by MAC. This is the color Soft and Gentle, and it's seriously my favorite highlight ever. It's so pretty. Um, I feel like it's very natural, which is nice. Next for eyes, I use the Urban Decay Primer Potion, and if you guys ever used this back, way back when, I was a ninth grader, I think, when I first found this, but um, it had the wand, and then they got rid of the wand, and I remember, like, you could look up videos how to depot the extra um, primer potion that was inside that little, like, hourglass. Do you guys remember those videos? Am I the only one who remembers them? <laughs> If you remember it, leave it in a comment, but that was the good old days of YouTube. Um, a lot of you guys ask what I use for eyeshadow. It's 
literally just the Naked Basics palette by Urban Decay. I don't use anything special. I just use the color Walk of Shame and I literally just put that over my lids and then I use the color Naked 2, which is this brownish color and I just put that in the crease. And then some days I will take Faint, which is this darker chocolate brown color and that is what I'm gonna use today and I'm just gonna put that in the outer corner and just blend that. For eyeliner, I have been using the NYX Felt Tip Liner. I'm gonna do this off camera because it's seriously so hard to show you guys how to do eyeliner. I'm really sorry, but so I'm gonna use the L'Oreal Voluminous Original Mascara for my top lashes. For my bottom lashes, I use the Pixi Lower Lash Mascara. I need to get a new one of these, it's starting to dry up, but. For lip colors, it just depends on my mood and the day. Sometimes I will use this one from Ulta. It is 225, it's just like a basic nude. I would put it on my hand, but I just put lotion on, so I don't know if I wanna use this one today or not, but sometimes I will use that one. Um, a lot of the times I will be wearing Midi by ColourPop. This is one of their ultra matte lipsticks. It is a great neutral color for my pale skin. Sometimes I will use this NYX lingerie lipstick. This one is in bedtime flirt, so it all just depends. So I think today I will do the NYX lingerie one. So this is my finished day today makeup. I literally wear this every single day. I don't remember the last time I did a different eyeshadow look, but. So this is my finished makeup with those lashes on. But that is everything for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and make sure to hit the subscribe button so you guys don't miss my next video. If you guys wanna follow me on social media, the links are always posted below. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.